Well, the Padres take the field tonight, led by Chris Paddock, who gets himself ready for start number 20 in the big leagues for the tall right hander. So two down here in the first inning for Daniel Murphy. Murphy one for eight, Ribby in the series. Swing and a miss. Boy, that fastball is moving like crazy. They dialed it up, big fella, from 93 to 95 and struck him out just like that. Right, the Padres dealing with Chi Chi Gonzalez. Well, Chi Chi has a repertoire of fastball, curveball, slider, and change. Uh, over 50% with the fastballs, but then he's got a mixture of all of those pitches. He's got to live on the edges. Manny, who has been struggling lately at the plate, 0 for his last 17. In the air to right field, sending Blackman back to the dirt of the track. He will have room as he makes the catch out there for out number two. Ball kind of died to right field off the bat. Looked pretty good. Two down. Two down here in the second inning brings up Rymel Tapia. And that one's hit well to right center field on the move is Margot. Not going to get there. It's going to one hop the wall. Tapia will put the brakes on at second base and hold with the Rockies' first hit tonight. What well, a great swing by Toppy to drive a ball to right center field. So two down, Toppy in scoring position. Here is Jonathan Daza. And a liner into center field for a base hit. Around from second comes Tapia, and the Rockies will strike first on top, one to nothing. RBI single for Daza. First Major League RBI gets a hanging curveball. Like he knew it was coming. That's right. Throw at third, Margot at second. Urias grounds one towards second base. McMahon's going to first, and the Padres are going to get their first run of the night in the back door from third. Comes Hunter Renfro. The game's tied one to one. Game tied one to one. Both teams with two hits as the top of the Padres order are going to lead it off in Fernando Tatis Jr. Which did Tatis is a one hopper diving grab made by Story. Gets up, throws to first in time for the out. We've seen spectacular plays from Tatis. We saw one from his counterpart right there, Trevor Story. And it was almost a look on Trevor's face like, hey, I'm pretty good at this job too at shortstop. Let me show you. Nolan Arnato stands in with one out, nobody on base to face Chris Panic for the second time ever. He's 0 for 1, grounded out to shortstop. 3 2 is hit to left, down the line, and off. The Western Metal Supply Company building. Touch him all time for Nolan Arenado. He just tied Trevor for the club lead with his 26th round tripper. That is now 18 home runs Chris Paddock has given up. And it's Hunter Renfro leading it off here for the Padres who now trail by a run. Drives one to deep left field, sending Tapia back at the wall. That ball is gone. Hunter Renfro answers. Solo shot is 31st of the year. This game is tied just like that, two to two. Didn't really catch all of it. That was actually off the end of the bat. And Hunter Renfro so strong, lifts that out easily to left. Jonathan Daza, who leads it off here, a single in the second inning, and he drove in the first Rockies run of the night. Opposite field and with some authority heading back is Renfro reaching up to make the catch is Renfro. He's doing it all tonight. The home run last inning now a great running catch on the dirt of the track in right center. Well all his teammates are loving this especially his coach Skip Schumacher. They have been working tirelessly in, on his defense and it has shown. And the Machado stands in here 0 for 2 tonight. Has flied out and struck out and sends one up the middle in the left center field. Naylor will come around from second base. Machado's thinking too. He is safely into second, and the Padres take their first lead of the night on top three to two. He's also made a great catch out there in right field last inning, and he's also doubled in this game. So two for two. And a liner that's a fair ball down the left field line. Machado will jog home. Heading for second base is Renfro to get there standing. His third hit of the night puts the Padres on top four to two. Renfro at second base, and here's Manuel Margot. And it's lined into center field, a base hit for Margot. Here comes Renfro, here comes a throw, and it's not going to be in time. Padres take a 5 2 lead, and with the throw getting away, take it second base is Manuel Margot. It's 5 2 San Diego. And two outs here in the sixth inning, and here's Arenado's third plate appearance against Chris Paddock. Fly ball to right field, in comes Renfro, out goes Urias, and nobody's going to catch it. 
around from second is story he scores and it's now five to three tying run at the plate right now for the Rockies and nobody out in the seventh inning one two pitch is hit well to right field going back is Renfro he's on the track he's looking up it is gone hit the top of the fence and went over huge swing a pinch hit two run home run yonder Alonzo and we are tied at five Renfro was tracking and tracking and tracking he got to the wall and he left and it was just out of his reach runner on first nobody out tie game in the bottom of the eighth Margot a deep left field Tapia going back look it up that's out of here two run home run for Manuel Margot puts the Padres on top seven to five there's a 227, 13 homers, 36 runs batted in. He's been starting quite a bit in the outfield, started tonight on the bench and pinch hits here in the bottom of the eighth inning. Myers to left field. Tapia going back at the wall. The ball is gone. Will Myers with a pinch hit home run to add on to the Padres, take an 8-5 lead. The story out there at second base. 15 pitches so far from the Padres closer with two down in the ninth inning. One two pitch. Hey stuck it out the Padres win. Kirby Yates picks up his second strikeout and picks up another save as Yates strikes out Daniel Murphy to end the ball game and quite a win here tonight for the Padres.